Maria Capone has been making a fuss lately at the Bulgarian National Assembly. From the opposition, she's accusing the government leader of being responsible for her country's corruption. When there are problems, they must be solved. The Commission is saying that these are political decisions to be made by Bulgaria and that Europe is tired of these broken promises. We need action, action to transform our country. Brussels announced it will freeze 800 million euros in aid after government officials diverted European subsidies and displayed ties to organized crime. Petya Stavreva, European deputy, finds the sanctions justified. We can see that the country has many serious issues to resolve, especially those linked to corruption and the correct use of European funds. If Bulgaria doesn't make the right decisions, the consequences could include receiving no more funds. Farmers and blue-collar workers will be the hardest hit by these sanctions. But according to political analyst Vladimir Shopov, no hard feelings against the EU on the horizon. There's no need to convince Bulgarians of the necessity to fight organized crime and corruption in the judicial system. Meanwhile, Bulgaria's rightist opposition has demanded to hold a vote of no confidence in parliament against the government.